So 80 volt batteries. So look like this on the market. So this is a green work. So cobalt that sold on the lows. And also they have a snapper. A snapper they, they claim it's a 82 volt, but, but basically they're the same. If you look at the picture, it's all look like this. So they're all same. So today I'm going to uh, tear down the battery and show you the inside. <laughs> The first thing I want to talk about the safety. Uh, use of power tool battery, it's much much safer compared to a third party, you know, made some batteries. Think about this is a this really strong case. Even you drop on the ground, probably you still survive, right? And also, why it's uh, why the company doesn't go more higher on the voltage? Usually people never think about that way, right? They think about the 80 volt probably on the market more than two years, I think. Uh, they did not make a 100 volt anymore, right? So this there's something, you know, about the safety. It cannot really go higher anymore. Think about that. If you put a... This is my uh, power adapter, so... I'll talk about this later. I'll just show you the first. So, if I plug this in, so this is a negative, this is a positive. I can just hold here. I won't get a shock. I won't get an electric shock. So I can just hold there. Think about, you know, the power outlet on your home, you can already just touch it, right? <laughs> you, you will get shock. So I think the 80 volt probably close some limited, you know, for the human. If it's 100 volt, you may be uh, start getting shot. <laughs> but usually the DC is not really hurting people. It's not like AC. AC actually can hurt people. But DC usually don't hurt people. But still, higher voltage is more dangerous to the, to the human. But usually we talk about, you know, 2 amp hour, 4 amp hour, something. But you never really think that. You see this, uh, this is a 20, 24 volt, and it also is a 2 amp power. <laughs> it still calls 2 amp power. And this uh, is the same thing. This uh, uh, EGO, this is a sold on the Home Depot. So this is a 2 amp hour as well. So the, the amp power doesn't really, you know, tell the capacity. The amp power you have to multiply the voltage. That's a watt hour. So watt hour actually talk about the capacity. You see this, uh, this is a two amp hour. On this one, they will list uh, 144 watt hour. And this one will list uh, 112 watt hour. So you can say this also is 2 amp hour battery, but this is a much lesser compared to this one because the wattage is less. Okay, check on the safety. You see this, uh, they have a circuit board, you know, protect uh, overcharge, overpower, uh, many things, you know, much safer, uh, you know, if you just buy, you know, the third party made the big battery, they may have a bigger capacity, but, uh, you know, compared to the safety and the durability, I think this is much better. Um, you know, they have warranty, I think the Green Works have two year battery warranty. Uh, also, they guarantee the over a thousand charge circle. This is a 20 cells, uh, each cell is 2 amp hour. And overall, you can say it's a 20 s battery. Um, and uh, right now you can find uh, each cell maybe uh, 3.5 amp hour is 
I think it's pretty common right now. But uh, you know, for those company, they uh, they produce a lot of product. They have to test the battery, you know, actually uh, for the safety, uh, durability, everything, you know, to fit their application. So they they not just claim I have a really big density of batteries, and they have to make sure they have actually, uh, you know, support you a couple of years for your use. Uh, yeah, this is kind of, you know, pro or con, you know, you, you got a really safe and durable battery, but uh, you kind of lease of uh, power density and uh, it's kind of a little bit more weight. They have bigger case to put in, so definitely get more weight. But whatever you you think about big, you want to big something big, you definitely need a bigger battery. So like if you want to build a electric cars, uh, scooter, and go car, golf car, <laughs> a trolling motor, you know, who like me, a personal aircraft, I I use those for my uh, power motor. You know, I actually fly with those batteries. Mm -hmm. So whenever you think big, you have to use big battery. And uh, I made this uh, <clears throat> uh, battery adapter, so you can you can actually order from my website. So they make a makes make your project much easier. So you just plug in, and you can you know grab the power from this kind of. Uh, power to batteries. Uh, let me show you how this works. So for the DC battery, for the DC battery, uh, the big thing is you don't want to mess up the positive and negative. So you, if you mess up your positive and negative, you will burn your device right away. It's not like AC, even you can mess up both sides, doesn't matter. But the DC, you cannot really mess up. So my adapter, you can only put inside one way. So if you want to put inside this way, because there have another things block it, so you won't put it in. You have to put it in just one way, you can put it inside. And you got a power. So, uh, so the negative and the positive never mess up. So yeah, that's the big things for the DC power. So you can use my adapter easily, you know, get, get you know, put a wire and link to your motor, was uh, ESC, you know, the controller or something. And this is a very simple and easy way to get your power and get your project done easily. And you can order those someone. I'm waiting for your order. I'm waiting for your order. <laughs>